But a lot of guys don't like when you do impressions of. Them. What what was Don Knotts actually it? liked it. Don, Don Knotts. Well, you do a great Don. Knotts. Well, he but you could do a good impression, but they don't like that you do the impression of him. But Don Knotts, I saw him at an autograph show, and he's like old, and he goes, right. and he goes, oh, it's you again. Do you do my signature too? Here, take a spell. I'm a little tired. Why don't you sign some uh. some. Some autograph for the people over here. <laughs> so yeah, sometimes they like it. He 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 really dug it. He actually said to me, "You do me better than me." Well, I, well, tell us about Jennifer Gray. You used to date Jennifer Gray. She went well, with sort of. Yeah. Well, it, we dated. Were you really, banging that? No. Because you auto really, love master. I gotta, I gotta tell you something. She did like the love master. As a matter of fact, I have another story about her. She was doing a movie with you know who Jennifer Connolly is. She's like really smoking hot, you know. Yeah, yeah, she's yeah. She's a beautiful yeah. mind, the black hair. Yeah. This is years ago. We're in Jennifer Gray's backyard, and she had played my CD for everybody on the movie set. So Jennifer Connolly's, oh, do you think you're great and all this stuff? So I see her years later. You ever meet a celebrity? You just make a fool out of yourself. And I, and I see her, and she's there with her now husband. You know this another actor from England, you know, Paul Bettany or whatever. I go, hi, uh, you might not remember me, but you're, you're, you're a fan of mine. I was, yeah. I was like, such an idiot. And she stared at me, just this death stare. It was horrible. I did not lose my virginity with Jennifer Grey. So to tell you the truth, what she says to me, we first, she was my friend for years. And she, we, now we're flirting and we started dating a little bit. She goes, I just want to warn you, I have the Midas, uh, what, do you, what do you call it, vagina? Yeah, she, sure, yeah, she I have the Midas that. vagina. She says this to me. She's, it's this like, before it's, you've it's seen before we did anything. She says, I just want to warn you, I have the Midas vagina because if you go near here, if you get this, you become famous. And she gives me this list. It was an unbelievable list. <laughs> like the was, yeah, Johnny Depp, uh, Matthew Broderick, Liam Neeson. What a slut. And I'm You're going, I, I, I'm going, this is unbelievable. I, if I just get there, the love master gets there, I'm gonna have a career. <laughs> what? Yeah, and, what? and then and then we split up, what but I never I that? never got the Midas. That's and horrible. that's why I'm here with you <laughs> as just a comedian working at the comedy works. Thank you, Jennifer and not Gray. talking about my Oscar nomination uh. of last year for True Grit. Uh. Now this this is how this is how it works. But anyway, so we're dating and this is after the nose job, right? Uh. And then she looks completely different. You know that, right? right she, from she does, from she Baby look, in the Corner yeah, yeah. and Dirty Dancing. Dirty Dancing. Was, they she like a, basically took out an entire, you know, it's there's Couple two feet. There's like two holes left. That's basically. <laughs> so she's unrecognizable. So we go on this date one time at the House of Blues, and we're going to see uh, uh, the Mavericks. I don't remember them, country band. They were friends of mine, like fans. And Trisha Yearwood was married to one of them. So that comes into the story later. So she's a country singer. Right? Right. I know you're wrong, but anyway. So anyway, we're sitting there with my friend Linda, and I go, Linda, this is Jennifer. Jennifer is Linda. Now, I said, let's go back to the foundation room. It's the House of Blues. I said, but they have that guy with the velvet rope. And then Jennifer says, oh, that's all right. I'll get us past. I'll just tell them I'm Jennifer Gray. And Linda has no idea. She goes, ha, ha, that's a great idea. And I'll be Shannon Doherty. Because I look more like her, her than you do Jennifer Gray. Trust me. And she makes it worse. And she goes, and I'll you say 902, and I'll say don't put baby in the corner. She thinks she's bonding with this semi-Jennifer Grey lookalike who really is Jennifer oh, Grey. Man. And I'm sitting there going, oh, this is not going well. <laughs> Give her the signal. And I, yeah. I, I wanted to cut her it's off, but uh, what was I going to do? She's laughing, and they're having this great time bonding as the as these celebrity lookalikes, and one of them really is the celebrity. So Jennifer so then, just thinks that she's just giving her a bad time. No, she knows. Oh, she knows that she with this, know. She's been living with this not being recognized for a long time. Job. So All she right. goes along with it. And Trisha Yearwood sits with us. She knows it's Jennifer Grey. And she goes back on stage. And what a great reveal. The three of us are up there watching. She goes, this one goes out to my new friend, Jennifer Grey from Be, Be My Baby from Dirty Dancing. And Linda st gave me this look like, I'm going to kill you. She's kicking me under the table. <laughs> you allowed her to said, go on and yeah, on and said, on. Why did you tell me I said her name was Jennifer? You're the idiot that went off on this whole thing. <laughs>